What's up, guys? It's Mark Today, I'm going to be showing you a new tank I got. And, guys, I'm been, I've been wanting to get one of these tanks for a little while. And some lady actually gave it to me as shown in the last video. If you haven't seen that video, check it out after you watch this. Um, we got, uh, well, we found a baby bird. But she gave me this after I gave her the bird. Check this tank out. It is a little two-layer tank. I'll get into the filter stuff first, but do you guys see what's in here? We have three baby bass. You see how small these guys are? Look, here's my finger. We have three baby bass. I have these up here because I had them in there, but it was just taking up too much space. Also, yeah, but check this out. And I have my pothos plant in here just to kind of make a little shelter for them. But, like, guys, check that out. Check those out. They're so small. But this is a new tank, and the way this tank works is that there's a filter up here, and there's a little hole in the bottom of this tank. And so it just filters through here, and there's a little pump inside of there, and it goes up and filters out. Guys, this tank is awesome. And in here, um, you can see we have two pregnant minnows. Um, there's the other one. And I'm going to take this salamander out. It's just temporary. Soon I'm going to put it outside, which I'll show you guys in, an, in a later video. And well, in a further video. I don't know. But guys, check this tank out. This is a new tank, and I've been wanting to get one of these, so I just said that earlier. And it's pretty awesome. But check this out too. In this tank, we have our final and last, well, final and last. Our final fish for this tank is a bass. Check this thing out. This thing is like, probably like, not even as big as my hand. It's probably like from my thumb to my tip of my finger. But, um, yeah. And him and the catfish are around the same size. So that's always good. I don't know why it looks so blurry. Like, check. Um, it looks just, just looks blurry. But yeah, so we got a new bass, new baby bass, new fish tank, and then we have these guys in here which aren't really going to stay. They're just kind of there to be there. But check out how big this one's getting. And you. And you, you're getting big too. Everybody's getting big. Everybody's getting big. Further plans of outside, I'm going to show you guys. I know I mentioned that, but look at this tank. Comment down below if you've ever had one of these and what other fish should I get for this because these guys aren't, and of course these guys aren't, they're going to all get big. So what fish should I get for this? These, gonna, these guys are going to get a tank soon, but I had these guys for a couple days and they're already starting to look at me. Let's see if we can feed them. So what I have to feed them is a cichlid pellet, but since they're so small, I crushed it up and put it in the top. So let's see if I put it right down here where the filter is. Come on. He looked at it. They probably won't eat right now. Probably gonna have to train them with like some guppy fry or something. Might have to get some from those guys. That's why I have them though. But guys, check these out. Our new pet baby bass. Amazing. And sorry if it has a little glare from the window, but oh man. So guys, comment down below if you want a piece. If you a piece. If you want a baby bass. Oh. I'm gonna show you guys. Check out this pothos plant. It's growing like crazy. But anyways, comment down below if you would like a tank like this or a baby bass. Wait, I think it just had a piece. Dang it, my, my camera's not focusing great today at all. But guys, comment down below if you would like this. A little update, a little thing. But I think I might know something I wanna get for this, but I'll save that for a future video. Guys, be awesome. Get yourself a small little tank like this, and bye. Also, get yourself some bass. You know, they're pretty cool.